Hello guys, before the video starts, I want you to check the quality of the video. Because sometimes YouTube automatically sets the quality to like 200 or the lowest setting. Put it to the highest setting for best video viewing or whatever. Then you want to subscribe with your nose, click the bell with your nose. Yeah, I totally clicked that with my nose. Uh, you can try it if you want, you don't have to, I'm not forcing you to. But the reason why I want you to, because I know you probably want a shout out. I do shout outs to lots of stuff, subs, like 300, 400, 500. Maybe I might do like a 375 right now, I don't know, or something, yeah. So do that, and thank you. Enjoy the video if you can, I'm sorry if it's cringe. Hello guys, I'm gonna be teaching, oh, I clicked the wrong thing. Great, I already failed. That's not TI-83. Hold on, let me go back. I'm so good with calculators, guys. I'm going to be teaching you how to get games on your calculator so you can play them in class. Yeah. Alright. Yeah, you guys get the point. Now, I am going to be showing you how to get games on a TI-84+. Plus. Now, if you have a Plus CE, then go to a different video, because this will not work for you, because you're going to have to download something, you're going to have to download this thing, and this only works for the 84, and I don't know if it works for 83. I mean, 84+. plus. So, yeah. Sorry if it's bad quality, by the way. Now, you also need this wire that connects to your computer. That's why I have a computer, because you can't just make your own program. I mean, there is a program button, but you can't just make it. And I still don't know what I'm doing. I think I clicked the wrong thing. Oh, well. So, yeah, let's get into the stuff. Now, if you were watching this and I just made the video, like, two minutes ago, I don't have the links right now, but I'll try to add in the links to everything. I'll have the links for every single thing, if I can. Alright, now... <clears throat> you're gonna download... What I just showed you? Hold on. TIA Connect. And, again, I'll try to put the link in the description. And this is for Win... This one is for Windows, but... I'll have the link for Mac, also. Now, you're also going to download Mirage OS. Now, there are other things you can download, too. You don't have to just download uh, Mirage OS. You could download something called Dorums, I think. But I did Mirage OS because I like it. So, let me show you what Mirage OS is. This is Mirage OS. And it automatically, like, puts the games in order from alphabetical order. See? I have a lot of games, so I'm only going to download one. Now, you also want to check how much storage you have, too. Uh, wait, I'll be back. Okay, I forgot where I was. My little brother came in, but you're going to want to... Oh, yeah, you want to check the storage by clicking second plus for the memory. Then go to two. You can just press two, actually. And you see that? Make sure your arch... I'm oh, sorry. Make sure the arch of memory is good. RAM doesn't matter, because you're going to be clearing the RAM. Like, in school, when they ask you to clear the RAM. Like, watch. You guys probably know how to. Um. See, second. Memory. Seven. All RAM. Reset. I resetted all of my RAM, but... That doesn't do anything to the games. You see, your games are hidden. As long as the teacher is not watching this video. If my teacher is watching this video, um, I don't have games in my calculator. This is totally someone else's. But yeah, anyways, you're going to want to plug in this thing into your computadora. That means computer in Spanish. Um, and then plug it into your calculadora. That means calculator in Spanish. I'm going to make sure I plug this in. Hold on, is this the right thing? Oh, yeah, it is. Hold on, I'm really good at calculators, as I said before. Make sure you plug it in, and it makes that click. Then, once you plug it in, go to your... Where'd my TI Connect go? Go to your TI Connect thingy. 
Then go to this one, Device Explorer. Can you please open up? Oh, it's loading. Okay, of course it is. Then you gotta play the waiting game. Then this screen will pop up. Now, if it's not connected, then this stuff is not gonna work. So keep on unplug it and plug it in. I'm gonna do that. And yeah, there you go. If this shows up, that means you can download games. So then you wanna um. Hold on, I'm gonna download a game. Go to this website. Actually, you don't have to go to this website. I'm not gonna put the website in my description, guys. You're gonna have to search this up yourself. Or actually, I'll put it in, because I'm gonna be nice. But search up calculator games, and hopefully TI-84 plus game um, comes up. And you can just choose whatever you want to get. I'm gonna choose a game. Okay, I'm gonna get Advanced Racer. So you click Download. Then it should download. Are you gonna download? Alright, then it should take you to this screen, screen and click download. And then play the waiting game. Okay, I accidentally downloaded it twice, but once you download it, you wanna, like, this is what I do. You wanna bring it to your screen. Um, hold on. Alright, so you wanna, like, bring it onto your... This thing, I forgot what it's called. On to here. Okay, it's not showing up. Oh, it is showing up. Okay. And then after you do that, go on to here. Well, actually, you should be able to right-click. Uh, the loading game. Waiting game, I meant. And then click to send the TI device. Now, if that doesn't show up, that is because... Oh, sorry. This thing isn't there. Or this is not connected. Make sure it stays on, by the way. If it's not on, turn it on. Then click Send to TI Device. After do that, play the waiting game. You gotta play the waiting game a lot, guys. I mean, it's really fun. Okay, make sure it says Archive. If it says RAM... Then switch it to Archive, because when your teachers say clear everything, it will clear off the game. That's why you want it to be Archive. Then send to device. And play the waiting game. And this should show up. If there's an error, then I don't know what's happening to your calculator. You need to make sure you plugged it in tightly. Make sure that screen is on. And make sure it is on now. This is happening, it, like, this thing just goes away. It's still on, though, as long as that's happening. And, yeah, I'll just... Oh, I guess it's finished. Alright. Now, if it turns back on... Now, when you download Mirage OS, you gotta go to your apps. Then go to Mirage OS. Now, my Mirage OS is at 6. Yours might be at, like, on the bottom. I don't know how I got mine to be here. But then go to it, and your game should be there. Now I'm going to actually check out this game. But yeah, hopefully this helped you. I'm sorry if it didn't, guys. I tried. Again, remember, don't say CE. Don't say 83. The game website will work for the 83. Um, this website will work for it. But you, Mar but Mirage OS, I don't know if that works on it, guys. You're going to have to try it out. This isn't loading. Oh. How do you play? Let me play. Okay, whatever. Oh, there it is. It's just slow. Let me play! Controls. Second is forward. Blah, blah, blah. Okay, yeah. Please subscribe and like. Enjoy your day. These four websites will be in the description. You only need three. I'm going to have four because of the Macs and the Windows. Um, Mirage OS, and I'll try to put this in, but yeah, goodbye. Comment if this helped you.